what's going on, Sam Rice, and welcome to today's video. I am Sam, and today I want to answer a question I got from the family guy, and that is, what type of equipment do you need to make YouTube videos? So I thought I would share some of my favorite gear for making YouTube videos with you guys today. Now, first up, the most important piece of gear you need is a camera. And my favorite camera right now is the Sony A6300. I love this camera. In my opinion, it is great in low light, which is very important when you're making YouTube videos because you never really know what your lighting situation is going to be. I really love its kind of slow shot mode. Uh, it really gives you those cool, crispy, cinematic shots you're looking for. It's lightweight, it can fit in my pocket. I love this camera so much. I take it scuba diving with me, but when I take it scuba diving of course I put it in an underwater housing because if I didn't bad things would happen next up audio is king when you're making YouTube videos I love this little Rode video mic it's very compact it's very small it fits right on top of my camera you stick its little wind guard on and you get some great amazing sounding audio for your YouTube video so I highly recommend this Rode video mic last up on my little vlog rig here is this Manfrotto tripod. This is an awesome little tripod. I love using it as a grip. In my mind, it feels much more comfortable to grab this than hold on to the camera like this when you're trying to vlog. I feel much more stable when I'm vlogging like this. Plus, it gives me those couple extra inches to get the lens a little bit farther away from my face. So if I need to set the camera down or get a time lapse or get a more stable shot, I can use it as a tripod as well. So I really, really like this Manfrotto mini tripod. Now, all the equipment you're going to see in today's video, I will put a link to everything in the description below if you guys want to go check it out yourself. Next up is B-roll. We need to get B-roll. We need to get cutaway shots. So you don't want to have a lot of thousand plus dollar cameras hanging around so my go-to always for b-roll are gopros i love gopros i have several gopros this is a hero 4 we have newer ones we have older ones but gopros in my mind for b-roll are king especially with all the different types of mounts and accessories you can buy because you can pretty much stick these anywhere because they're nice and small and get those cool shots or run super long time lapses so i always keep gopros in my bag when i'm going going out. That way, if I need to grab a quick shot or a quick time lapse, I can. All right, Sam Rice, say we want to be a little more cinematic. Say we're feeling artsy that day. My go-to camera for cinematic shots is the DJI Osmo. I love this camera. I love this camera so much. I named my dog Osmo because I love this camera so much. When I want to get cool, moving camera shots that are really slick, I go to this unit instantly. This is my favorite tool in my camera bag. So I highly recommend if you're looking to do some cool moving cinematic photography to check out the DJI Osmo, or if you need something a little bit bigger, you can also check out the DJI Ronin. Okay, say we wanna step up our cinematic game even more. So now we need to add maybe some aerial footage. I love using this little mini drone right here. This is the DJI Spark. A couple things I really like about this drone is one, it's form factor. It's small, it can literally fit in my camera bag. I can get it up and running in a few minutes to get aerial cinematic shots. Now, a couple things. When you're gonna use a drone, you need to be responsible. You need to use the drone responsibly. Do not you know, fly this in places you should not fly a drone. So that's the only warning I'm going to give you guys about drones. But again, any of this equipment that I talked about in today's video, links in the description if you guys wanna go check it out yourself. I also have videos that I've made about most of this equipment. So if you guys wanna see those videos, I will put those links in the description as well. Last up, sometimes we're in dark places. So we need to add a little bit of light to our life. I love little portable compact lights. Their price is coming down every single day. So I highly recommend in your camera bag or in your vlog bag, throwing a couple lights in. That way, if you guys need to illuminate something, you can. 
All right, Samurais, I'm going to make another video talking about what equipment I use when we go to do a corporate shoot. So if you guys wanna check out that video, make sure you are subscribed. If you're already subscribed, make sure to share this video with your friends and family and to follow me on all my social media at Sam Angel. That way you guys know when new videos come out. Also, if you like today's video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you have any questions about any of the equipment I talked about or anything I said, feel free to ask them in the comment section. Again, everything I talked about today, links in the description and until next time remember to dream big think bigger and always be you i love you guys and i'll see you next time bye